The popularity of goats has really increased. Over the years, people now equate goats to doing fire fuel breaks. The interest has sparked you know, cities and, and the counties and the state to, to look into the viability of it. It's a natural resource in the sense that the restoration and the habitat is here. Goats are very much like a fire without the flame of a fire. They can bring all the, the critical elements of the plants that are here back to the soils and regenerate the native plants. So a natural resource in the sense that it's good for the land. The goats take a product like this dry mustard head and brush and they'll clear the dead and the duff, which is a fire problem, and they'll turn it into an open space like this. But then in the pellet, it's got another unique form that inside the pellet, they've crushed it and modified it so much that it's just literally dried pieces and small, small particles of eaten vegetation. And this area is a buffer. We're trying to take away the ember and the transfer of fire when a catastrophic fire actually does occur. By treating these open spaces, this is one community, this is one hill that when the fires are going off in the backcountry and the winds are blowing into our face and the embers come in, this won't light up. And that's how fires jump fire lines. That's how they go into communities.